Hi, in this video we're going to be talking about Dropbox Replay and what that'll do is it'll allow you to uh, share and collaborate uh, with other people with your videos and that way they could kind of um, add comments and mark them up and you could go through different revisions until you have the final product the way you like it. So to use it you just need to go to the Replay site. I want to make sure you're logged into your Dropbox account first so it'll connect without any problems and then click on Get Replay and then once you're there it'll take you to your replay page and it'll have the sample video and this one I have there from before so you just see the sample video and what you could do is you could click on this sample if you want to look at the demo do a little tour if you want and you could see as you play it you kind of watch it and then these little markers here correspond to what comments have been made so if I go there this one's this guy says let's lighten the shadow here and then he replied I'm on it and then if you go here can we swap this for another picture? She's able to draw a circle around it and that kind of thing. And then you could have different versions. So right now this one only has V1. And you could add a new version from Dropbox or upload it from your computer. And then you have the status. If you want to check the status, to needs review, in review, or approved, or cleared the status, and that kind of thing. And then, of course, you could add your own comments as well. And then you could look at the unresolved, resolved comments, and all comments. So to do your own, let's get out of here. Uh, you can either create a project or just add files right to the main thing. So let's say we're going to create a project. We're going to call this Puppy Bowl. Based on the video I'm going to be adding. Okay, so now we have this thing here. So we could uh, add a video from Dropbox or we could upload one from the computer. I'm going to add from Dropbox. So I got my... Uh, Went to my files here because I'm logged in. Click on add. And so now we have our video here. We could open it up. We could play it. So now as we're going along, we could, you know, add some comments if we want. So let's say we don't like this name. And then post it. So now it puts our marker right there. And as we're going along, you know, add other Iggy. comments if we want. We found out during this recording, Iggy loves to pick up everything. And if there was a contest for cutest dog. And you could add smileys and that kind of stuff. And then you could also mention somebody. And you could actually see some more drawing tools if you want. So let's post that. Okay, so now we have our video there. So let's say we want to, let's put it in needs review status. And now let's share it. So give the person either review and comment access or view only access. So we're going to do uh, review and comment. Copy link. So now we're going to go to our email and send them an email. Okay, so that's been sent off. I imagine at some point maybe they'll, you know, they'll let you uh, share between Dropbox users besides just copying links here. Obviously, you know, you might not be a Dropbox user. That, you know, or might not have a Dropbox user that wants to, that needs to edit this video, so it might just be a non-Dropbox user, I should say. Okay, so now let's go to the person's email we sent it to. Okay, so now they have this uh, link here from the email. You can click on it. And if they're logged into their Dropbox account, they'll open right up, assuming they need to connect their account to this, uh, to the service as well, too. And then once they're there, they'll be able to see the comments. Play the video, reply, that kind of thing. And then they'll be able to see the resolved and unresolved comments. And then if they go through and they 
make some changes and they could go through and say, I approve. Okay, so now if we go back to the original viewer here, let's uh, go back and refresh here. And you can see that her comments have been made there as well. And still nothing in the resolved because we haven't resolved any yet. So as you can see, you know, it's a pretty basic tool, but it's kind of cool if you have your videos in Dropbox and you just want to collaborate between each other and go back and forth and add comments and then, you know, update different versions and change the status and so on, you know, clear the status and whatever you want to do and take it from there. All right, so I'll put a link to the uh, Dropbox replay in the description there and then you could sign up and try it out and see how you like it. All right, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe. Thank <laughs> you.